Hi all, let's see what is RabbitMQ on MOS Transist and why RabbitMQ on MOS Transist. Let's see. Before seeing RabbitMQ, let's see what is message broker first. Message broker's main responsibility is to broker messages between sender and receiver. That is, once a message is received by a message broker from the sender, it routes the message to a the receiver. The sender, we can also say producer, it's responsible for sending a message. Uh, the receiver, we can also say consumer, it's responsible for receiving a message. And the queue uh, is a storage where messages are stored. When the sender send a message, the message broker received and distribute to the receiver. Now let's see what is RabbitMQ. Uh, RabbitMQ is one of the most widely used open source message broker service. It's a common platform for sending and receiving messages and your messages is a safe place to live until received. The advantages of RabbitMQ is scalability, lightweight and very easy to deploy and share data with whoever needs it, better user experience due to asynchronous processing. Once a sender or publisher or producer send a message to RabbitMQ, the RabbitMQ distribute the received message to the receiver or consumer. Let's see what is MOS Transist. A MOS Transist is open source software, .NET based enterprise service bus software that helps .NET developers root messages over RabbitMQ, Azure service bus, SQS and ActiveMQ service buses. That is lightweight message bus for creating distributed application. Example, the transportation of large number of people by means of uh, bus, uh, subway trains, etc. Like this, mass transist message bus send a message from publisher to RabbitMQ. And once RabbitMQ gets a message, mass transist in consumer receive message from RabbitMQ. Let's see how to set up RabbitMQ in our system. We have to install ERLang and RabbitMQ. Let's see. For installing ERLang, uh, go to the website www.erlang.org slash downloads. Let's see. Here, uh, for installing Windows, click this uh, download Windows installer. It will download the uh, exe. You can install it. I already installed that. Let's see next RabbitMQ. For downloading RabbitMQ, uh, go to the website rabbitmq.com. And here, click get started and click here uh, click download installation here you can see install windows uh, click the rabbitmq server uh, 3.9.13 exe it will download the exe install it i already installed that once rabbitmq installed successfully it will start in the port number 15672 in your browser type HTTP colon slash slash localhost colon 15672 and press enter. It will show the login page in username type guest and password also guest and click login. It will redirect it to the dashboard. Uh, in our next video, uh, let's see how to create a user and ASP.NET Core application for sending message to queue in RabbitMQ. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.